is uh, the homeless shelter, um, which appears to be coming to North San Rafael. Uh, Director Kai uh, spoke before uh, San Rafael, uh, objecting to it, spoke well uh, as an individual. But I do think uh, it's important that this CSD uh, uh, have a formalized response to San Rafael. We have problems with homeless in our parks now. We have no way to, uh, we have no enforcement mechanism. This is going to be a problem that we're going to all have to live with. Um, I live close to the park. I see homeless uh, folks using the, the park uh, once or twice a week. I'm sure it's going to grow. And this problem is not going to go away. And um, as leaders of the community, I hope that you uh, take this challenge to uh, the quality of life here in Renwood seriously and, and make a, a protest. Thank you. Just so everyone knows, I want to add to that that the city of San Rafael, as well as our district supervisor, have have all stated that <clears throat> that the location in North San Rafael is one of multiple locations that they are considering. And from my understanding, from the city of San Rafael and from the county, they are not. Zeroing in on that necessarily, and I'm not saying that they are or not. The end. What was conveyed at the town hall that Supervisor Connolly held this past week, was, along with what was said by Santa Fe City Councilman John Gamblin, is that <clears throat> there's a permit process that would need to happen before anything were able to happen. It's a permit process for San Rafael, though, right? It is. Understand. So, as as concerning as this may be to anyone, it, it's I, I would I would say if anyone's concerned about it, reach out to our district supervisor, our county supervisor, and or um, city council members of of San Rafael. Giacomini is their their lawyer. <laughs> it's genius. Take all your homeless and send them to Marin. <laughs> well, and well, we're. Well, I don't know. We're going to have so, a problem because I mean, how who are we going to send up to clear out the homeless? I mean, it's it's a serious. So <coughs> before coming in and any further on this, I, the the proper protocol would be for you know if there were any member of the board who wanted to see this as an agenda item, for us to pursue it that way. Um, as we all know, it's not homelessness per se is not within our <coughs> jurisdiction, but Sorry. Sorry. there but there's concerns that potentially translate to the services we're responsible for.